Most visitors to Yosemite National Park come during the summer when the grass is green and the rivers are full. But during the winter months, Yosemite is transformed into a quiet wonderland. Winter storms blanket Yosemite Valley in a mantle of white, and the summer crowds are replaced by winter wildlife. Streams have icicles, and the iconic cliffs are frosted with ice. A favorite winter destination for over 70 years is Badger Pass Ski Area. Just a short drive from Yosemite Valley, the road to Badger Pass climbs 3,000 feet from the valley floor. At this higher elevation, more snow falls, and the views from the top are like no other in the park. Badger Pass is the original ski area in California. In 1935, when they opened up the Wawana Tunnel, they built this uh, uh, great little ski area, and at that time, it was one of the premium ski area, premier ski areas in the whole of the United States, believe it or not. 88 acres of land that has groomed every day to perfection. The great thing about Badger Pass, you're going to find here that you may not find in other ski areas, is that it's small, family, uh, intimate. It's a great place to come and relax, but it's also a great beginner area as well. A lot of people will come here and learn how to ski and snowboard and they'll take that, that uh, knowledge that they've, they've learned here in this non-intimidating environment and then take it on to the other bigger ski areas. If cross-country skiing in a national park sounds like fun, Badger Pass offers over 90 miles of marked trails and 25 miles of groomed ski tracks. It's a great way to get away from the crowds and experience the solitude of winter firsthand. We have a tubing hill, which again ties nicely into that family type tubing hill that's uh, about 75 to 100 yards long. It's a non-intimidating hill and uh, a lot of people who don't want to do any of the skiing or snowboarding activities end up uh, gravitating towards the tubing hill. Snowshoeing is becoming very popular now. There's some great trails out there. We also even have the National Park Service range of lead snowshoe walk that takes two hours and that leaves uh, from the base area at 10.30 each day. For those who aren't comfortable on skis, Badger Pass still has a few other activities to offer. After a day of fun at Badger Pass, head back down to Yosemite Valley. Enjoy evening light on Half Dome while gliding across the ice at the Curry Village Ice Rink. After the sun is set, warm yourself by the fire at the historic Awani Hotel or at Yosemite Lodge. Winter in Yosemite is magical. There's simply no place else where winter feels quite like this.